Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022 Gold Rush autographed jerseys. It's a multi-sport break, six boxes, which is a whole case, random letter break. They're going by the first letter of their first name. And actually, let's go back to one. We, so the next break is already loaded up. So it's a 19 spot break. So for example, if we pull an each row and you have letter I, you get, you get each row, for example. I think most of these are going to be custom jerseys. We may see some some officially licensed ones as well, but it looks like it's, yeah, it's a multi-sport, including some soccer. Those are all the letters right there. Also, the Eagles multi, the QB multi-sign jersey will go to letter E, and the University of Kentucky jersey will go to letter U. I'm not sure if there's an example of that over here, but just uh, just keep that in mind. All right. So this is break number one. You can see that the next case is already in the store. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Let's randomize you a letter. Let's roll it, randomize it, five and a one, six times. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Six and final time. After six, we got Tana down to Chad. Five and a one, six times, four, the letters. And after six times, we've got Z U down to P. All right, Tana with Z and U, Chad with C, Jim with T, Chad with E. Adam with NV, uh, James FH, Tano with B, Chad MS, Andy IK, uh, Nancy L, Chad WY, and J, Jake with R, Ben with A, Chad with G, Tano with D, and Chad with P. So let's sort uh, alphabetically. And remember going first letter of their first name. Now we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades and then we'll have the break. Stick around. We've got the case right here. Stick around. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, everyone. Oh, I forgot to write TWC in the chat. TWC trade window closed. Big thanks to everybody here. We're going first letter of their first name. That should make this break pretty easy. We've got six jerseys in here. We've got the... Uh, Gold Rush seal right there. <laughs> Dropping my knife, I thought I was gonna stab myself. If it's Pele, it'll go to P. Let's just make that easy on ourselves. All right, good luck, everybody. Oh man, Rex, I wish I had Stormtrooper gear to wear while I watch those shows, but that's not in that's not in the budget. I'm gonna turn off that top camera right over here just for a second because. We're going to take a look over here. We, we don't want to reveal it too early. Who are you? Do you have the names on? Do they have a name on here? Oh, I know who this is. All right, we can play a quick, some quick rounds of who am I. Nothing else is sold out after this, right? Was everyone going to leave, let me leave? Uh, leave early without doing the double header? I hope so. <laughs> it's, my, it's my Friday. I'm Jason to do the double header tomorrow. Uh, Brian, it, oh sorry, uh, Brian is his name. What's it? So B, Tana, you'll get it. But Brian who? Played for two teams, mine, two NFL teams my entire career. A former second round overall pick. Four-time first-team All-Pro, second-time All-Pro, 
nine-time Pro Bowler, part of the NFL 2000s All-Decades team, a PFWA All-Rookie team, ended my career with 1,147 tackles, 26 sacks, 36 forced fumbles, 19 fumble recoveries, 37 interceptions, and four total touchdowns. I'm in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. It is not Brian Urlacher. g has got it. It's Brian Dawkins. That goes to Tana in the letter B. Got a cool auto. There's the Beckett sticker right there. So these are uh, custom jerseys. I think I'm just going to leave them inside this. Uh... Yeah, you can tell that you're just custom jerseys. I'll leave it nicely folded in here. Ah, oh, Carl's going to make me work tonight. This would have been a great game for uh, Aaron Judge cutting. <laughs> Does he always do it on his own runs? I know, that's when we, that's when we need the Aaron Judge cut-ins. All right, so I guess Carl's going to make me do the double header tonight on my Friday. Just trying to get out of here. But no, Carl's like, you got to work, Joe. All right. Oh, next you saw those colors right there, but who are you? I'm a pitcher, starting pitcher. I bat left, but I throw right. Think of a different Mets pitcher, Grizzlebees. Played for the Mets my entire career, four-time All-Star, two-time all MLB first team. They do that now. Two-time NL Cy Young, an NL Rookie of the Year, an NL ERA leader, and a two-time NL Strikeout leader. He's pretty darn good. He's going to be a free agent at the end of the season, too. Um, through 2022, 82 wins, 57 losses, a 252 ERA, 1600 strikeouts already, a whip of 1.00. That's right, DeGoat says Grizzlebees, DeGrom says Nate, both of you got it. Oh, this might be, uh, yeah, this is an official jersey. So I guess there are some officially licensed jerseys mixed in there. That's awesome. There's this auto there, Chad with the letter J. There you go, Chad. Actually, should we take a look at this? These are, these are pretty cool. Nice. It's even got the... Uh, even has the uh, Nike retail tag still attached to it. Nike tag on the bottom as well. I'll get this folded up nicely before it goes anywhere. All right, third one. Gotta be this player, right? All right. Um, I am a right fielder, 25 years old. Bats left, throws right. There's a lot of bats left, throws right here. Uh, lifetime 268 batting average, 73 home runs, and 256 runs batted in. I've been an all. I was an All Star this year, actually, and the AL Triples leader in 2020. Not Ben Intendi, not Cedric Mullins. 
He's with the Astros. I'll give that away because it's not this is a letter break, not a team break. I'm gonna take one more guess. That's right, Kevin M. Kyle Tucker. There's his autograph right there. Pretty highly touted prospect. Beckett card, Beckett sticker. It's right over there. Custom jersey. Andy with the letter K. We got a basketball player. Twenty-four-year-old basketball player for from uh, Nolens, born in New Orleans, Louisiana, 6'3", 185, point guard in the NBA. Went to high school in Texas, went to college in Kentucky, and was a fifth overall pick. I'm still with this team. Was first team all SEC, SEC all freshman team. SEC Tournament MVP, McDonald's All-American. And uh, what did he do last year? Had, had average about 23 points a game, 3.9 rebounds a game, 5.6 uh, assists per game. Not Tyler Hero. John Wall's not 24 years old. John Wall also has not played for one team his entire career. He was the fifth overall pick in the 2017 NBA draft. Not Emmanuel Quickly. There you go, Kevin. It's a fox in the box, De'Aaron Fox. There's the Beckett info right there. There's his autograph right in the middle of the five. Another custom jersey. No, no, like NBA logo man up there. Letter D. That's for Tana with the deer and fox. All right, I'm a retired basketball player. Born in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I'm 52 years old now. 6'5", 195. Was a, uh, well, yeah, was shooting guard, small forward. Went to high school in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Went to college at Three Rivers. Uh, Three Rivers College, a public community college in Poplar Bluff, Missouri. And then transferred to Alabama, played there in the early 90s and was a first round pick, 24th overall by the Golden State Warriors. Played for the Warriors, the Knicks, and the Timberwolves. A four-time NBA All-Star, an All-NBA first team, NBA All-Defensive second team, All-NBA rookie second team, second team All-SEC, SEC All-Defensive team. Ended up, with, uh, ended up averaging about 18.3 points per game, four assists, and about a steal and a half per game.
you know, I also have a legal issues section <laughs> in uh, here, and there was a there was a bit of a bit of a choking incident with a, with a coach. That was unfortunate. No. Thought the choking the coach would. There you go. Yeah, Spree, Grizzle Bees. Latrell Spreewell. Another custom jersey here. You got the JSA card and all that information. There's his autograph right there. All right, letter L. That'll be for Nancy, for the letter L. All right, final one. Good luck, everybody. All right, we're going to end with a retired football player. We're going to end with a retired football player, uh, retired a long time ago. You got to listen to the clues first, Carl. Who am I? I'm 71 years old, was born in South River, New Jersey. Six foot two, 12, a wide receiver. Played with one team my entire career. Went to college in Tulsa, went undrafted, and then ended up in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. A Super Bowl champion, a three-time first team All-Pro, a three-time Pro Bowler, an NFL receiving yards leader, part of the NFL 1970s All-Decade team, and part of this team's Ring of Honor. Played 156 games with just one team my entire career. Played 10 years in the NFL. Uh, ended up with 489 receptions for 7,822 receiving yards and 48 touchdowns. That's a lot when you're playing in the, in the, in the 70s. Uh, he Cowboy. So think about... Dallas Cowboys number 88 back in the 70s. Not Largen, not Blitnikoff. Well, what was he doing? He, he did a little bit of coaching with the Cowboys in 85, the Dallas Texans in 91. Um, was an executive for an AFL team for a year. And then uh, for another couple years, another Champions Indoor Football executive there as well. Not Dupree. You'll know his name when I say it. Dorsett is a running back, I want to say. This is a wide receiver, number 88. And this was still the days when they, when numbers meant something when you played a football position, Chad. In April 28th, 2017, I was selected to announce a pick in the 2017 NFL Draft, which took place in Philadelphia. It missed booze from Eagles fans and attendees. He let out a dramatic speech and announced Chidobe Awuzie as a 60th pick for the Cowboys. Cowboys Hall of Fame wide receivers in the 70s. Oh, no one's getting it, huh? This goes to Tana and the letter D. It's Drew Pearson. There's Drew's autograph right there. There's the Beckett sticker right there. And that goes to Tana once again and the letter D. That's it, folks. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for playing Who Am I? I'll see you next. There's another case loaded up, so I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.